Isabel Redmond's spruiking potable recycled stormwater, but the government says its experts argue there's not enough evidence it's safe. The health experts are telling us it cannot be considered safe for human consumption. The opposition wants treated runoff to top up the main supply. Once you put this stuff into the mains water supply, there's no recalling it if it's a bad batch. The public of South Australia should not be used as guinea pigs. But the Liberals insist no water will go near the mains till they're certain it's safe. We absolutely reject that assertion and I think it's a sign of an increasingly desperate government that are really stormwater sceptics. She had high profile support from her federal leader in the Riverland to see the dire state of the Murray. I don't see any reason why the technical issues couldn't be overcome and I certainly think to rule it out uh, just shows uh, a government which has run out of ideas. Meanwhile, the Attorney General's drawing fire over comments on a national computer game show. He's received written threats at home for blocking a national push to classify R-rated video games. My family and I are more at risk from gamers than we are from the outlaw motorcycle gangs. Gamers for Croydon are contesting Mr Atkinson's seat and two others at the election. It's actually kind of worrying that he's ultimately responsible for keeping South Australia's streets safe if he thinks that gamers are more of a threat than um, organised crime. Tom Richardson, 9 News. Adelaide's 9 News at 6.